and they push it up. That is Harris McBride handling up the floor with an assist. Carter with an finally assist. with the bucket, and it's the first points of the ball game here. Nancy talked about, um, oh, we Steal have Steal by Nye into the open court, with and the finish. first bucket of the game and the season will go to Aaliyah Nye. Chemistry is something that the girls are going to focus on. They're working on that. Um, Feed to Lopez, turn around, easy bunny for Lopez on the assist from Aaliyah Knott. Brown spots up, oh. in and out, offensive Kendall board Bostic. for Kendall Bostic. How about the defense there from Giovanna Lopez? She's walled up a few times at now, and in after Porter has a couple of fouls. Now Lopez gets a feed and her second bucket, and Illinois into double-digit scoring. Peebles, for example, who led the Illini. Um, she wants the easy shots for sure as it's stolen away. Williams with the easy lay-in, and Central cuts it to a five-point lead for Illinois. So she did not start, um, but she uh, came in not too, not too in after, and that's not nigh for the two. Those are the easy shots Nancy wants. Didn't get the foul, so down low, so... Let's see what we can do on defense. Yeah, long two. No good, but cleaned up there by Williams. Nye from a distance. Ooh. Nailed it. The high-low game working for Illinois here early, and then Aaliyah Nye. Um, and uh, she's leading in steals with three. Tough shot for Odin. Oh, what a nice jumper. Odin, quick to the hoop. Gives it to Ruben. Who puts it up and in? What a nice feed on that trip down the floor. Yeah, and it's still, it's still. This one into the clear for Odin. Oh, block from behind. Bostic follows it up and one. Ball's going back and forth. Um, but Illini was able to finish on that one um, with the and one. Well, I know we would see an even bigger score difference, um, but they're not far off either, so. Knifing through the zone, Morgan Callahan. NC Central won't be home for a long time until they take on um, Johnson, well Johnson and Wells on December 20th. Backdoor so cut, nice find there, and it's put in by Taylor Williams. 13-point lead for Illinois. Peebles kicks out for Odin, looking for a three. Nothing but net. Show other teams what they will see this season. Drive by Nia Ford, gives it over for Hope. Hope lifts it and nets the J. The line I, but I think she's hoping to uh, dish the ball a little more. Outlet Peebles to Bostic and the finish. And they're on pace to get past that 70 point mark that we talked about in the open. Under two to go here in the first half. And that one was telegraphed and a steal. And Lowry finishes the layup. Now to an 11 point ball game. And right away, Illinois forces the Eagles into a turnover. Anastasieska will go baseline. Dumps it right in there for Bostic. Back to a 16 point lead now, the biggest of the game for Illinois. They have not led except for 2 0. And Carter finishes with the right hand there for the Eagles. And now another steal and a quick layup. Back to back buckets for the Eagles. Odin, the freshman ahead for Brown, the transfer. Brown had it swatted away. Transition D is looking good for a line eye. Pretty jumper by Lowry, who got herself wide open. Many of those turnovers. Yeah, nearly a dangerous pass there. Aliyah Nye spotting up for three. Good again, her second from distance. Failed screens attempts from Lopez. Um, not exactly sure what they're attempting. Nye wants it again. There oh, and go. she's good again. 14 point lead. Odin has to try and get through a double team. They find Lopez, and now a cutting Bostic's wide open, and Kendall Bostic into double-double territory. 
first of her career, making a mark here after playing her freshman season at Michigan State. A steal by Peebles. Illinois can get their biggest lead here. Peebles has the shot bothered, but Bostic gets the and one. Um, six turnovers in the last three minutes for um, North Carolina Central. So, um, Ashland Lockard finding a jumper there. The Eagles out of the MEAC, Mid-Eastern Atlantic Conference, and a finish there by Lockard, who's starting to have a little presence here in the third quarter. Illinois still has been out-rebounded by two by the Eagles. Final minute of the third quarter, Jada Peebles. She once had a 25-point performance against a, a team that's had some success through the years, UConn. And she was with Cal. Madeline Anderson. Nine and another player left someone wide open and she got that. She got that um, easy shot wide open. No numbers, but Lowry still finds herself open at the free throw line. And that plus uh, being exposed to four different systems has uh, really influenced her to want to take on coaching after her playing days are over. And that's important when you want to score 70 a game. Um, I will say that we are shy of that. Callahan finishing there. Peebles for three from the corner. Off the back iron, weak side rebound, Nye. Nye off the glass and good. That their energy levels stay high regardless because they have a lot to do. Nye and one. Peebles feeds Lopez. Lopez, good feet, draws the foul. I'm not used to seeing that, but I'm a believer in it after tonight, um, or this afternoon. High bank shot, good for Lockard. Nancy mm. Fay with 772 collegiate victories. Lockard is starting to fill it up. A little bit out of control at times. Like that last offensive foul, but so much there. There's a nice shot, high arcing from Nia Ford. And the Eagles will press, you can bet. They'll try and create some turnovers. Odin, though, will streak to the cup. It was in Illini's best interest to um, clear everyone out and let um, Odin bring up the ball. And with her speed. Anderson again from three in the corner. And Ruben going up at the same time. Uh, their chemistry is definitely um, in the <laughs> Nye at this point just doesn't matter what she does. It's going to go in. Talked about it at the outset. Nancy Fay wants to be scoring at least 70 points a game. She got to that threshold here. Demila Brown adds to it. Madeline Anderson for the Eagles. Now to Lowry. One more shot. Nope. Rubin will... Bring it in, and Illinois will win their opener. 73-56, the final.